After this video, you know how keyword arguments in Python work. Let's explore it on a function to order coffee. Here we pass a fixed parameter on position one called size, and at the end, optional undefined number of keyword arguments, which we will use for additional details to the coffee marked here with star star quarks. To visualize and show how this concept works, we add some print statements in here. First, we print the inputted size. To get all quarks, which are stored in a dictionary, we have to loop over it and print all key value pairs one by one. We can grab them by using the items function on the quarks dictionary. To prove we have a dictionary, we add this line, and that's it. We can already use it in an example. Let's say a customer want to order a coffee of the size medium, and we have the details like price temperature and intensity. As you see, we handle here a float, an integer, and a string without defining it anywhere. When we run this, we see all values are printed to the console. First the size, then the details, and the quarks dictionary. But you don't have to stick to the quarks syntax, because only the stars indicates the quarks here. When we change the name from quarks to details, we get the same result and the code works the same. So it's getting more descriptive and better readable for everyone. Any question, let me know in the comments.